In the late 70s, just as disco died, a new form of music emerged. Yes, we are all here enjoying one thing universally, it's music. No fights, no gun violence, none of that. Just people having a good, raw time. This new genre was house music. On the south side of Chicago, a group of young DJs caught the vibe and made the music their own. House fans flocked to underground clubs night after night, dancing until the sun came up. Really, house music saved my life. Because you, you were either going to be a gangbanger or you got into this house thing. It was an extremely violent holiday weekend, and the numbers that we are talking about are staggering. We're talking about 70 plus people wounded in gunfire. Another dozen people House music, the true beauty and essence of Chicago. That's us. 25 years ago, the chosen few DJs created a house music reunion picnic for a few friends. Today, 50,000 househeads travel to that sanctuary along Lake Michigan to experience the joy of the music. The good things that happen in the neighborhood or in the hood, those don't get a lot of light. The negative things get blown up and it makes it seem like the Chirac and all of that. We don't say that. It's got a beat, you can dance to it. It might be fast, it might be slow, but it's generally a good bass line or sometimes it's not. There's some chords, or sometimes it's not. I mean, it's, it's everything, everything is house. I still want to wish the chosen few DJs and all of you a happy 4th of July and a happy 25th anniversary chosen few picnic. Love you, Chicago. This is the untold story of the chosen few DJs and the largest one-day house music festival in the world.